What is crackalackin' bowlers? Chris Beans here with Bowlers Rant, and it is that time again. New stuff is coming out today from Columbia 300. We are taking a look at the return of the beast. Let's take a look at them now. Not one, not two, not three, but four new balls for this line. And the best part about this, two of them are hybrids and two of them are pearls. Woo, really, really like the pour on these balls. Love the logos. I gotta tell you, I'm a big fan. I like how this pour and logo combination came out, especially on the pearls. I'm loving the sparkle. Let's jump into the specs because that's what it's all about. Uh, these balls contain the Bendit Coverstock. That's a very interesting name. And they contain the Beast Core. They're all part of the same series. So you've got Bendit Hybrids and Bendit Pearls. They come at a finish of 500 Sea Air Micropad with Crown Factory Compound and Crown Factory Polish. That's important because these balls are about energy retention and these balls are going to give you quite a bit of length, being that compounds the equivalent of 2500 and usually polishes around 5000. Let's take a look at the core. Now they're the same in all the balls, you know, so the cover um, color here would vary from each ball, but it's gonna be the same uh, beast core and looking at the shape, it does look like your traditional vintage light bulb style core. Okay, and the numbers at this for this core at 15 pounds, 2.540 RG with a 0.033 differential. All right, now let's move on to the flyer because you know this will kind of put pull it all together. So the two at the top, uh, you've got the uh, red, blue, and black. That's a hybrid reactive, and then the one to the right of that is the black, pink, and purple. That is also a hybrid. Okay, so two shiny hybrids, and then the ones at the bottom, you've got um, pur uh, purple sparkle and blue pearl. Okay, so they look really, really solid. Uh, and you can see uh, in the description uh, below that these are for your skid flip type of reaction, light oil, and should provide everybody an entry level performance. You know, if you're looking to get into the bowling game, but you don't want to, you know, break the wallet. Some additional information here from Columbia 300. I say, it says, and I quote, for decades, Columbia 300 has been revered as a leader in providing outstanding entry level options. And it was one of our goals to prefer, preserve this reputation by introducing familiar products in this category. The Beast was a great addition to Columbia 300 line last season, and we're bringing it back. There are four beasts total to cover a wide range of color options, including two new hybrid options for added performance. The colors are purple sparkle, blue pearl, blue, red, black, and black, pink, and purple. So that leads us to go right back to the original uh, picture because we can talk about shelf appeal. They look outstanding, okay? I'm really liking the, uh, the purple and blue sparkles. They should look really good on the rack. And the uh, hybrids above, uh, you can see the, um, the red, uh, blue black that should look really good going down the lane as it transitions through all three phases of ball motion um, all overall looks like a really good offering for league you know pick your favorite layout and you're off to the races of course if you are a light rev player you're going to want to make sure you go with a pinup layout again get your pap checked because you want to make sure that you use a valve angle of about 40 degrees or less and the high rev players if you're looking to uh, use something for when they start to get a little bit beat up uh, you might still see a little bit of an over under so you might need to take a little bit of an Avalon pad and scuff up some of that shine so you get the right reaction dialed in um, going back to the information it looks like the release date for this ball is June 9th 2020 that's for all four of them and of course if you're interested in learning more about these balls and where you can pick them up I've got links in the description where you can grab these on bowlersmart.com so what do you think of the return of the beast would you get the pearl would you get the hybrid would you get one of each and if so what colors would you choose Drop me a comment, let me know, let's continue the conversation. More updates are coming and thanks for watching.